is about Richard Johnson. He's been stood down for the rest of the day. We're hearing he's had a kick on the calf, but he, he was helped to his feet by a couple of people. So we're hoping that the news will be better of Dickie in a, in a day or two. But he's been stood down for the rest of the day, and his rides in the later races have been taken by other jockeys. Noel Feely will ride Hammersley Lake, and Robert Williams will ride Artie Campbell in the last year. So news of Richard Johnson, all that we have at the moment is that he's had a kick on the calf, he's been stood down for the rest of the day, and we know no more than that. So we'll keep you posted if we do receive any more news on him here. Number five, a test now. Support has come for this horse. Is now your favourite with Rossetti, the second favourite in here. Ebony Express, 477 days the layoff, but we all know the good doctor can get them pretty fit. He's already been on the score sheet here this afternoon. But I think it looks like they'll go a decent gallop here. They've been orderly fashion and very well behaved, but I thought that was a hell of a performance in our previous race by Tempestad at Floresco. I think he's a force to be reckoned with when the ground is decent because he showed he's not a one-trick pony. Really good ride by Harry Cobden. And interestingly as well, it shows you how tough it is to get rides at this time of the year. It's his only ride of the day. Martin Harris with the call here. On handicap hurdle, running to the first of the nine flights, a test and Rossetti are the show with Ebony Express close up between runners. Navan on the outside is handy as they reach the first flight. Rossetti landed just in front of a test. Ebony Express in third. Hollybush Henry away to the inside. Navan seeing plenty of daylight. Warsinger settles last. Rossetti the second flight by a couple of lengths. Rather keen as they head to the third. It's Rossetti from a test with Hollybush Henry on the inside, and then Ebony Express, Navan and War Singer over the next flight of hurdles, which Hollybush Henry didn't jump well, and nor did the back marker War Singer, which cost him a little bit of ground. Quite a long run to the fourth. It's Rossetti and Noel Feely in front, racing quite keenly with a test just over a length down in second. Hollybush Henry against the rail is third. And then Ebony Express and Nevada on the outside. And the last to clear it once again was War Singer. Well grouped though as they come up in front of the on the long run between flights four and five. It's Rossetti with a length advantage over a test. Nevan improving on the outside of Hollybush Henry with Ebony Express now dropping back into fifth. War Singer remains the back mark way to the fifth flight of hurdles with a test. Navan and Hollybush Henry giving chase ahead of Ebony Express and War Singer, who again lacked fluency over that flight. One more to cross on the far side. Rossetti leads a test, and there's less than a length between them now. Navan's improved Bush Henry with Ebony Express between the two, and War Singer remaining last, but well in touch as they turn briefly right-handed on toward fourth from home. Rossetti and a test in the air together that time, two lengths in advance of Nobini Express. Over the rise on the far side, Warsinger remains last, but he's only four lengths behind the front-running grey Rossetti as they run towards the end of the back straight. On this long run between four out and three out, Rossetti, steady fractions in front, under Noel Feely with a test and Harry Bannister continuing to sit a close second. Navan and Tom O'Brien closing up on the outside. Then Hollybush, Henry and Harry Stock on the inside of Ebony Express and Sam Twist and Davis. Warren remains the back marker, but little more than three lengths would cover them in what's been a very steadily run race. They're into the final half mile now with three to jump in the straight. Rossetti away to the inside. Inside led over it from a test. Navan now coming off the bridle as Ebony Express begins to close in, but Noel Feely has quickened the tempo from the front on Rossetti. Running out Rossetti with a test now coming up sides. A test jump. Ebony Express is three lengths behind in third, then follows Walsing and Navan, and finally Hollybush Henry. Into the final quarter of a mile they go. A test has gone. Ebony Express comes out of the pack into second. Rossetti runs third, then Navan and Wall Singer, and finally Hollybush Henry. Final flight of hurdles.
The test is only a length and a half in front. Ebony Express is trying hard to challenge in second. Navan is rallying in third into the final 50 yards. It's a test. Holding on gamely from Ebony Express tight at the end. Ebony Express has certainly closed right up on a test as they cross the line. Navan has come home third clear of Rossetti and Walsinger. Last to finish was Hollybush Henry. I tell you what, it's warm here and I'm sweating, but I can guarantee you one thing, I won't be sweating as much as Joe D'Amato will be to get the result of that photograph because I'm not sure if Ebony Express has nailed him, but just got off this horse, Harry Bannister, just after the line here. I don't know whether it's, something might have gone wrong. But we haven't had the result that you want to hear is number five and not number four. Still waiting here. Yet, but it looks like a test has just clung on. But I would not like to be sweating. Here we come. Oh, oh no. Ebony Express has nailed the test on the line oh Sean well that's racing, as they say, and it was a very, very competitive race. This is we heard a comedy. A test went to win his race. He went on, but Davis is a strong, strong man, and he was in pursuit, and that was the clue there. There was only about three parts of a length jumping that flight, and Ebony Express was getting there. A test needed the line to come, but he, you'd have to say, even four or five strides from the line, you thought he was going to hold on. It's just there, right strides, that his strides shortened significantly, and Ebony Express has done enough. Uh, to get there. First start for a long time for Ebony Express. Had a long